we all love doing events, right? Group rides, races, and such. As, where do they come from? Do they just fall from the sky fully formed so that we may partake? No, somebody's got to create them. <laughs> We're here at Flagstaff Week with Mr. Flagstaff Week, Mr. Mosaic, Aaron Barczyk. That's right. How are you, sir? Mosaic Flagstaff Week. Love when, it. When, I, this has been going on since I remember. That's not the case. When did you do the first uh, one? First one was sometime around 2010, 2011. What was yeah. the idea? I mean, the idea was, I was really out of shape. I was starting a small business, Mosaic Cycles, and I felt like I needed something to just like kickstart my summer. And I thought, let's get together and ride Flagstaff, which is a pretty long climb in Boulder, Colorado. 4.5 miles, 2,000 feet elevation, average grade 8%. Steep, yeah. it is a hard steep, ride. But it's super fun. It is super fun. Um, and more fun with fun. friends. It's way more fun with friends. I think year one was just some buds. I think there was like five of us. Uh -huh. And then there was like 15 of us and then 20. And now we just have you know a nice community of people. Some people ride in the morning, some people do it in the afternoon. Um, we do t-shirts and... Uh, you know. <laughs> now it's a thing. We, well, it's a th it's, you know it's a thing when there's a shirt. Right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So Flagstaff week, is it's a work week, it's uh, a banker's week. That's right. We ride Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Monday, Tuesday... Seven o'clock sharp in the morning. From the coffee ride right. here. Yep. Tranquilo. Usually, as tranquilo as you can go the, up an 8% grade for four and a half rules. miles. rules, like Monday and Tuesday are usually... Um, just like we call it, like we just roll out and it's nice and easy and we catch up with people and we chat and then it gets a little spicy Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Yeah, so yeah. We like to keep it chill and then let everybody loose towards the end of the week. I've been riding a different bike each week and been talking to folks about how their rides have gone. Let's check it out. So Flagstaff week is so big, even the Californians have come to infiltrate. It sucks at uh, coming from sea level, but you know, <laughs> we have to represent. It's like Christmas in June. Best week of the year. We love Flagstaff Week. Good morning, Good Ms. Barczyk. How are you? Good, how are you? Ben. Doing great. Doing great. So Aaron and I, Aaron couldn't figure out how many years this has been going. How many years has this been going? You've, I'm pretty you're sure You're the it's brains ten. of the aberration here, okay. I'm pretty sure it's ten. So we just told our friends, and then our friends told their friends, and we, we sent an email a week before to just people we knew and said, hey, this is coming, show up. Yeah. Um, but it otherwise hasn't really evolved much, to be honest. Like, we've always stuck to one flag a day for five days. No more. <laughs> don't make it freaking, don't boulder it. <laughs> right? Right. And. Doesn't have to be like a gravel thing. Like, your race is 100 miles, mine, mine's 150. Oh, yours is 150, mine's don't one nothing, everybody. No, like, no, like people, gotta go get to, people gotta get to work here. Yep. Grassroots, by word of mouth. Welcome everybody, cheer people on at the top, and then make it just slightly challenging, right? Like, five flags in a week is, is not nothing. And then have some fun. Give away prizes, right? And just be stoked to be on bikes at a warm, awesome, beautiful time of year. Yeah. See all your friends who maybe you haven't seen in a while. Yeah. That's the jam. Yeah. Thanks for putting on the party, Liz. Yeah. Exactly, the man, the myth, the legend, and the map maker. Tell us about super flag. What is a super flag? <laughs> a super flag is flagstaff, but super <laughs> longer, harder, better. And today, just like every day this week, we go to the mailboxes. Day five. So we're going to do a punch, and then we're going to give away a signed copy of the oh, flagstaff map. Yeah. 4.6, about 2,000 feet of climbing, almost 600 meters, because we like to do metric and imperial. Flagstaff is about three miles, and this is where everybody gets a little feisty in the beginning, and then people almost want to vomit near here. Yes, been there, done that. Been there, done that as well yesterday. You get to the amphitheater turnoff, which is here, and then it gets hard. And especially gets hard through here, the steep switchbacks, which is around 16%. 16 to 17 percent and then we've got 320 meters of the wall which is basically the same gradient as the individual time trial in the Giro uh, just a couple weeks ago yeah that was 15 percent for five kilometers this is about 15 percent for 320 meters so everybody gets a little taste of how difficult it was for the pros in the Giro and then from there just maybe another half mile three quarters of a mile to the mailboxes. Everybody can rally at the top. There we go. Let's do it. Good morning.
morning boulder it's mosaic flagstaff week monday morning seven o'clock start up starting the climb of flagstaff week 2023 Ooh. what have we here what is this we have a punch card for every day that you do the super flag you write your time which i don't know what i did <laughs> Top three right here. Keller, Fiona, Cookie. Right. Bye now. Yeah, Save some donuts, go go. Time to watch to the uh, restaurant <laughs> and just hold it there. Yeah, yeah. Have fun storming the castle. Are we are going hard. I am going hard. What are you talking about? This scene is a little crazy. Uh huh. <laughs> Come on now. Hup. Hup. Yeah. Good morning, Mark. Good morning, sir. Thursday morning. Here we I are. Miss, I missed yesterday. How did we go? It was hot. It was real hot. Time? I did a 26.30. Mother trucker. And uh, 26.30. Still got humbled, beaten oh. by three minutes at the line. What? By Mr. John Keller. Oh. Who oh. was uh, certified. He was moving. Hey, Pablo, how'd you go today? I won as well as I could go, considering the legs that I have, ha have after Ramba. Born Fiona. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Ano you had another bike switch. How did we go today? Excellent. Put on full tobo. Yeah. Ready to send it. You, you stick it to this guy? I did. Yeah. yeah. Good. I dropped him, you know. Excellent. <laughs> Excellent. You carry the weight of all of us in Drop exactly. Killer. Thank you for your service. <laughs> John Keller, 23 flat. Yep. Jesus. According to life segments, so we'll, we'll see. Pretty, pretty cracked. How but, fast could you go if you were rested? <laughs> well, this is the third day in a row of like 20 plus minute efforts. So, I don't know, maybe 30 seconds faster. Ridden a different bike every day. It's been all analog bikes. But today, for Festive Flagstaff Friday, Busted out this BMC Road Machine 01 Amp X e biking, baby. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, Scott. Fiona with the right move, I'm like, I'm oh, following that girl's wheel. Your rate of ascent, I guess about 1500 VAM. That's the rate.
So Strava for your Thursday, your sent yesterday Thursday said 381 watts. What do you weigh? Like 105 pounds soaking wet? Uh, to be honest, I don't even weigh myself. So. It's coming back. Don't call it a comeback. Cookie's always been here. It's like 95 years old. Still got that tour Utah form. And I love the front row seat that this e-bike has allowed me. Normally I'm like 20 minutes back there and dizzy and covered in sweat. Thanks BMC. e-bike on full turbo <laughs> I'm always obviously still working just to stay on young Keller's wheel Whew. black staff week good stuff welcome to Bola Connor how you like the wall no oh, it's not even breathing that guy's a freak we're gonna ask some other people that's not normal right there <laughs> hard to show how steep this bloody wall is how steep is this <laughs> Too steep. The wall of Flagstaff, how does that feel? I got some of those watts. <laughs> Day number five on the wall, how you feeling? Awesome. <laughs> all right, all right. How you like the wall? Whoa. Whoa. Yes, sir. Yep. Yep. It's all, you know, I'm all fun and games until this battery dies and then, then the tables will turn. How you like the wall, Meredith? Uh, uh, the view up here is pretty sweet though. <laughs> Can't beat that. Facts after we get started off as a fun social thing, now it's gotten way so serious. Way too serious, I can't even speak. This gentleman here already had the world's lightest gravel bike shave some weight off of it just for Flax F week. Oh yeah, you should see the inside of my stays and my fork. I specifically did it last weekend knowing I was right. going to be doing this. Yeah. Thing. I didn't even want to go to Unbound. I was like, you know, if I go there, get some of that Flint Hill grit, rub it against my frame for hours and hours and hours, and you'll be ready to go. Now look yeah. at you, you're flying up the wall. Yes, absolutely. So much Oh! Better. Oh! Oh, the money shot. <laughs> this man always delivers. Oh, oh, yos. It's right there in his name. Mr. Elf, you blew your beard off you were going so hard up the wall. Dude. Now you got a mullet. Now you got the carpet's carpet. I was gonna say, sweating balls otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> well done, well done. Yeah, Liz. Okay, I'll trade you bikes for the downhill. Okay. Here we are. Last day. I'm right. There was a lot of bleeps yeah. during that ride. No, was, that was great. That was fantastic. <laughs> well, I love having the uh, front row seat. Front row seat. That was pain city. <laughs> trying to follow this kid around. I think he's just, uh, eight, 28 years younger than me, and it's just trying to keep up living in his world now. <laughs> We're all in living in Kelly's world now. Yeah. But the most important question is, what's your rate? And um, I thought that was a VAM question. I was guessing like 1500 I thought so. That is you a know? finance question. I don't know. I don't know nothing about finance. Finance. You should ask about my rate. Though. What is your rate? Doug? My rate is two point six two five. And who did the mortgage? <laughs> Matt Cook. The best yeah. in the business. The best in the business. <laughs> thing, brother. Hello again. Can someone find my pocket? Yeah. Yeah, I got it like unzipped here. Yeah. There you are. Oh. How do you like Flagstaff Week? Ah, uh, I like it. <laughs> I don't think I'll ride super flag for a very long time, <laughs> but it got me out of bed in the morning, so it was good. All right, all right. What do you think of Flagstaff Week? I always die on Flagstaff Week. <laughs> Just a tradition. It's a joyful <laughs> way to die. Old fat guys. 
Slow death. <laughs> it's all in good fun. I love it. <laughs> I'm a list person. Love to punch it off. Like it's just like a ton of satisfaction that you get when you cross something off your list. So when you get to like punch it, it feels so good. <laughs> no whammies. No falling on the floor. Falling on the floor is highly discouraged. And that is a wrap for Mosaic Flagstaff Week 2023. If you find yourself in Boulder, Colorado, you got to go ride Flagstaff. You can pick up my man Zach Lee's maps of the Boulder area and of Flagstaff in particular to get the, the nitty gritty details on the route. Stop by, see Josh here at the coffee ride and go see Aaron and the gang at Mosaic. So thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and hopefully this might plant the seed for you to start your own cycling tradition. People love coming out for an event. Most of us just need an invitation. <laughs>